Hello everyone and welcome back to my next episode in my Dark Souls playthrough. Well, we didn't travel very far at all in the last episode, but I feel like we accomplished some pretty big things. And speaking of big, I managed to take out this gigantic ceaseless discharge demon-like thing. Oh, he drove me crazy, but it did make the victory so sweet. But in defeating him, a bunch of the lava kind of like went away and there's some new paths down here that we can go. Now the creatures down here are really strong and I don't think I'm ready to take on more of this section just yet because I'm starting to run low on arrows. Not to mention we opened a gate all the way up at the top still and I feel like that is probably where I should be trying to go next. So in this episode, we're gonna work our way back up through Blight Town up to the top and try to see what's on the other side of that gate. Hopefully gonna have a great time along the way. If by some chance this is your first time finding my channel, welcome. Hope you have a fantastic time. And if you do have a really good time, it sure does help me out if you consider hitting that subscribe button. All right, let's not delay any longer. Let's hop back in here, work our way through the Blight Town, which is not a very pretty sight, and see if we can find out what's on the other side of the gate up above. All right, everybody. Oh, welcome back. Uh, I don't think I had any soul. No, wait, 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 wait. I did beat the uh, that one demon. Okay, so we're going to run down there and pick up my little pile of souls before we head out. I made the decision after... You know, between it's still the same night. I didn't take very long a very long break, um, but I decided I am going to go back up top. Uh, the fact that those things give me twelve hundred souls each is fantastic, but I feel like I need to either make some more gear. I uh, needs not the right word. I want to make some more gear improvements, and I definitely want some more arrows. I like being able to like trigger these guys one at a time. And the fact that I have, I might have enough arrows to pull them over here and kind of take them out a little bit at a time. But that leaves me no arrows for going back through Blight Town. And we already know we got a bunch of them bugs over there. Arrows are the best way I found to take care of those bugs. Cause this long weapon, it does not work very well on the bugs. So uh, that's my plan. So we got a bit of backtracking. Uh, I do know also, I haven't went all the way to the other end at the base down here on Blight Town. So we might hit that bonfire first and continue that direction to see if I can find the boundaries. Find out what else might be available down here. Cause I know I had a lot of people tell me that Blight Town, as uninviting as it is, does have a lot of stuff worth exploring for. So the ultimate goal is to make it all the way back up to the smith and maybe get to see what's on the other side of that gate. But y'all know me. I get distracted so easy. Who knows? Let's see if I even make it out of Blight Town. I, I definitely have a reputation for getting very quickly distracted. All right, now that I can repair all this stuff, I'm going to... Part of me wonders if I should put my fast moving stuff back on. Um, you know what, let's go ahead and patch it up. Otherwise it'll keep showing up in my list. It doesn't need much. Uh, oh, I forgot, I can do like weapon upgrades and stuff from here if I got the supplies. I just ain't got no supplies. Hmm. Okay, for the bottomless box, I definitely want to put in that armor that was like the fire resistant stuff. I don't need that on me. Oh, okay. That's all done. Let's work our way on back this way. I'm gonna keep this armor on for now. It's just so cool. Uh, now I did keep the armor set that I was running around with so that I was light. So at some point, if I'm ready to do like fast rolls or I'm fighting a creature where I feel like I need to be able to move a little faster, I will be sure to put that back on. But right now, I've ran most of this playthrough so far looking like I'm running around in uh, scraps, bits, and pieces. So I want to take advantage of this. Oh, what's this say? Hidden path ahead. Is it though? I thought... Oh, that's probably one of those liar moments. I obviously don't know the game well enough to be able to tell when somebody's telling a lie. But I'm sure I'll hear from comments. This place looks so cool. It looks like a big spider nest, don't it? 
That was so cool. I haven't edited that video yet. I'm looking forward to getting that one put together. I think that'll be a fun surprise to see I pulled that one off in the same episode as well. It still bugs me. I had to run away from the wolf, but I will get revenge on that wolf. I think I want to do some experimenting too with some, uh, some of the swords that I've collected. I've definitely heard that there's some that I have that are really good swords. Um, I think I'd want to level them up first, which means I need to get some souls. That way I can raise them up. Because right now, if I take, if I grab a sword and start using it at its base level, I'm going to probably feel so weak. Be like, no, give me back my weapon. All right. I'm pretty sure I checked around this corner already and there wasn't anything over here. But I want to double check. Yeah. I'm officially in Blight Town. And I was thinking my best chance of getting across without being poisoned was going to be over here. Oh, speaking of that, I should probably put uh, that back on. I'll leave the other one off for now since down here I don't have to worry about the toxic stuff. Just the poison. That way I don't accidentally... Because I already got one... Oops. I already got one I accidentally used. Back when... Uh, a couple episodes ago now. Yeah, there's definitely some areas up there I haven't fully explored yet. I think when I go back, I want to go up on the way that I came down. Because there was a couple paths that I did not explore um, I know there was the one spot where there was the big tentacle thing but I think that's the one that I killed and I want to see what what it was blocking I'm assuming there is something there oh I tried to jump eee. oh that was close just made it alright Got the rock guys over there. Yep, my best bet's probably go this way. Are you gonna come in here or are you gonna make me go all the way to you? He's gonna catch me in the water. Might as well might as well start this. I can't tell, is there one or is there two? I thought there was just one. Nope, I see two walking this way. He ain't happy. Ooh. Ooh ah. Good. Go ahead, roll it that way. Oh, I'm glad those things fall. Ooh. Oh, I just turned around. That rock was flying at me. I'm so glad that uh, the rock falling on you after you kill him doesn't actually hurt you. Oh, come on. You chump. You're not going to get any closer? Do I got to shoot you with an arrow to get you to come closer? Fine. I'm probably going to get poisoned. Yeah. I didn't think there was a way around that. Okay. Mm. Oh, he's rolling. Uh. See it. Village. Give me the poopy. I wonder if I should be using that stuff. It works like a poison, right? The way the description worked, it almost sounded like it's a, a poison type thing. I could throw at enemies. Run. Made it. Okay. Let's just say. Be weary of fatty. Okay. I will try to be weary of fatty. I wonder if that bug's gonna come over here. Sounds like I might have triggered it. I'm gonna try to save some arrows. Huh. Oh, he dodged it. Got it. Now, I saw this... I think that's a slug over there. And I remember running away from it, like, oh, well, I don't want to 
trigger that a possible. Ooh, looky here. Well, I'm getting poisoned. But I found a goodie. Poison Mist Pyromancy. Yo, in. Okay. Oh, uh, get out of the poison. You know what? I'm already poisoned. Let's go across this side. Oh, and I hear a bug too. I forget what I was about to say there for a second. Um, I know doing this swing seems to work better on the bugs than just straight up stabbing them. That misses a lot of times. There we go. Got it. Is it coming this way? It is coming this way. I wanted to look at my stuff. Oh, yeah, yeah. I was talking about this slug. Oh, it sees me. Uh, I was avoiding them at first, but someone told me that they actually have a chance of dropping um, a very valuable resource. The large, large shards, I think it was. So I was like, oh man, I need to be fighting those. Backing away. Oh. Oh. Looked like he was about to lunge at me. Gonna drop me something good? Man, that thing is nasty looking. Oh. Come on. Uh. You missed. Oh, thank goodness. Alright, let's use this. Let's look at what we found. So I found a new... Ooh, Great Chaos Fireball. I don't remember buying that. Did I buy that? Poison Mist. So Art of the Flame of Chaos, which engulfed the Witch of Izalath? Izalith and her daughters. Hurl a giant chaos fireball. That sounds fun. The Flame of Chaos can melt stone, producing a short-lived lava glob. That's cool. Unique pyromancy crafted by Ingai or In Ingui. In Ingai. I don't know. Considered a heretic even at the Great Swamp. Creates a poison mist. Maybe it's Eugene? No. In Ingui. I don't know. Became an egg bearing undead. Oh no, who serves a deformed young girl who speaks an unintelligible tongue. Oh, I wonder if this is the guy that we just found down there in front of the the spider lady that's like on the lower level. Remember how one of those egg guys talked to us first? I wonder if that's him. Wow. Well, if I'm going to add more pyromancy abilities, i got to add more attunement slots, if I understand that correctly. Oh, wait, I found armor, too. Tattered cloth hood. I wonder if this was his armor, too. Since we just found that on him. Hood worn by pyromancies of the Great Swamp. Though it appears tattered, it is actually quite strong. Their attire offers substantial protection against poison, fire, and other forces of nature out in the hinterlands where they were driven. Hmm. Well, that's got 23 for poison. Wow, that is even better than the thief. And it's lighter weight. And it's got more durability. My goodness. That might be my new winner for lightweight. Fifty nine for poison resistance. Wow, that is incredible. Robe worn. Okay, yeah, it's the same thing here. Huh. I love finding new gear, even though I've like worn so little of it. It's just it's so cool to find it, you know. Uh, was it the heavy boots? This is so lightweight. Very, very lightweight. Amazing. Okay. Definitely found some good stuff this way. Whoop! Yeah. Any hidden walls? Okay. I'm gonna try to go that way. There's the bonfire! I can't wait to hear what you guys think of that. I wonder if I got anybody. With my little acting like I couldn't find it a second time. I was pretty proud of that. Hopefully you guys, hopefully you guys got a good laugh out of that. 
I probably wouldn't have thought of doing that except for the fact that there were so many people that were like, I can't believe you just didn't look right to your right or right to your left. Because, you know, depending on where they were talking about in the video, they're like, you would have seen it. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to, I'm going to act like I don't see it again. Just to see. <laughs> oh, it went behind the bush. You suck, dude. Oh, I forgot I got it. That would probably work just fine on too. Uh, call me Robin Hood, baby. That's right. Okay, where are those slugs? Oh, but if I kill them out there, that means I gotta run out there to get it, don't I? Oh, there's a tree branch I can run up on that. Oh, there's a bunch over here. Oh, come on, you guys. Oh, dodged again. You suck. Did that one drop something? Oh, no. Wow, there are a bunch of these slugs. Let's try this. I uh, got one coming behind me again. There we go. You didn't drop nothing either. Where's the bug? I keep hearing it. I don't want it sneaking up on me. Done eight. Eight left, seven. Oh, sidestep. Mmm, you suck. You suck. All right, well, it looks like I'm just gonna have to embrace the poison here. Thankfully, the poison doesn't hurt too quickly. Oh! I don't know how badly these guys hurt, though, but... Ooh, I got a good hit on that one. Ooh, he hit me with something. Man, not a single one dropped me something. I feel ripped off. And drink. Hello? Hello? Anything? Yeah, I see you floating over there, bugs. Okay. Back into... Oh, oh! I thought I was going to make it out on that one. Glad I got quite a few of those. Oh, I see something here. Oh. Come on, one of you guys, give me something. You guys are supposed to have some goodies for me. Nothing. Wow, there's a bunch of these. Oh! Better be careful. I might be able to get a backstab on me or something. Oh my goodness! And boom! Oh, come on, how did I miss? I was like, I'm gonna do the spin swing because there's like no way to miss. I was gravely mistaken. You know, I wouldn't be a bit surprised if at some point through here I end up coming across some gigantic slug. I just feel like that's a thing that could very easily... Oh my gosh! Dude! There's one. Ooh, get out! Uh. Yeah! Oh! That one was right around the corner. That was terrible! I'm sure they did that on purpose. Like, we're gonna get a good, nice little surprise out of this guy. Yeah, I backed out of that poison. Oop. Huh. Look at my nice little pile of slugs over here. Look at that. That is all the way out there in the middle of that. I was ready for a slug that time. There was one over there. Huh. Oh. I was like, I think I only got the one. There we are. Okay. Go ahead and top off. Look at that. These three are all guarding that one, too. 
they are not moving. Okay. Oh. Ooh. I think I just found a weapon. Man, I killed a lot of slugs getting over here, didn't I? Mm. Here it is. Server? Hmm. Hey, it's actually got a C for dexterity. That's impressive. Curved greatsword. Slash type. A curved greatsword used in a mysterious ancient rite. Imbued with a frightful occult energy, which restores HP with each hit. What? Insufficient strength to wield this weapon with one hand. Hold with both hands to use effectively. Oh my goodness, look at the size of this thing. Whoa. <laughs> From the picture, I thought it was gonna be like a short little sword. This thing is massive. What are the requirements on this thing? Oops. So I need 24 strength. I'm at 16, oh, wow. I have just enough with both hands. Okay, well we at least gotta test it out, all right? I ran all the way back here to get this bad boy. I gotta test it out. Anything else? I don't see anything else that way. All right, well we got that one branch-like thing that I saw where it definitely looked like we'd be able to climb it, I guess. Yeah. I knew it was gonna happen. Let's see how far I can go before I have to take that off. This thing is huge. Come here, you guys. I want to show you something. Oh, did you see the jump attack I did? Oh. Oh. He had a jump attack, too. Okay. Starting to become a bit of a big deal here. Okay, the jump attack was pretty awesome, but it definitely feels weak compared to what I'm used to running with, but it's not leveled up at all. Might be worth leveling though. Might try that toy out a little bit more. Go back to this. Oh, I did finally, I had some people clarify I was, so when I made this a raw, oops, when I made this raw, uh, apparently the bonus like the dexterity bonus that you get is a lot less and it doesn't scale as fast in the raw form so it's good for short-term gains but if it's a weapon you're going to use long term it's recommended that you don't make it raw because you can actually level it higher and get higher bonuses on it but this is more or like if you were maybe a magic builder or something and you're not going to be able to get those really high dexterity numbers and such you would want to go through the raw form because it gives you a nice boost on lower type weapons that maybe wouldn't work as well. If I'm understanding that correctly, I'm pretty sure that's how that plays out. Thank you guys again for uh, giving me more feedback on that to clarify. This looks pretty cool. What am I gonna find over here though? Are we entering another spider area? Not a trap, is it? It's kind of scary. Immediate hidden path. Pillage. A plank shield. Oh, ho, 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 ho. imminent, I think is what they said, not immediate. Illusionary Wallhead. Another one? 
try dashing through. Well, first, let's open this. Ooh, I like it, that. Oh, <laughs> there is another one. Wow. The Great Hollow? What? Where does the Great Hollow go? Oh boy. I just got 400 souls for some reason. Oh boy. Look at this. It's a whole nother area. What? Look, it goes down so far. This was not supposed to be the way I go. I got a gigantic lava place on that side to explore and then a gigantic hollow tree on this side to explore. Oh, man. <sighs> okay, well, we're going to kindle this bad boy. That way I can get ten flasks. Mm, yeah, we'll use a we'll use a double since I ain't got none at the moment. There we are. Reverse hollow. Well, if nothing else... My goodness, I got so many places to go explore now. This is crazy. Yes, Kindle, please. There we are. Okay, so I think... Yeah, I ain't, I ain't got this stuff there. Let's, let's go ahead and repair my stuff. This elite armor is epic. I ain't even leveled it. Now, I know. I probably don't need to level it. But I'm probably going to. Just because I like to. All right. We'll remember this. This is not where I want to go right now. I want to see what's on the other side of that gate. I feel like... I almost feel like... I, I realize that you can kind of, I guess, do the story in whatever way you want to. I, I don't know. Maybe there is no, like... I, <laughs> I'm so confused. The fact that I can access all of these areas... It's just mind-boggling to me. I feel like I'm not supposed to be here yet. Because when I rung both bells, something way far away is what opened up. And I'm like, okay, well, that must be where I'm, quote-unquote, supposed to go next. But I keep finding new places. <gasps> Ooh, how do I get done to you? Oh, I see more slugs. All right. We're going to go grab that. Oh, that brings back all this stuff, too. I forgot about that. Can I drop off? Ooh, drop shot. Uh, yeah, boy. <laughs> I don't get to do it very often, but when I do, it's really awesome. But yeah, I want to go up there and see what's on the other side of that gate. Oh! Alright. I don't think I'm getting... I, I think I'm going to get poisoned again. I don't think there's a way around it. Oh! See, I, I feel like I'm on land here, but it's not. It's more poison. All right, green shard. Anything back this way? Okay. Keep working our way around. That's just crazy. I did not expect... I mean, I guess that is a big tree. <laughs> and it goes down. It's like we're going into the root system of that tree. That's just... That's amazing. Absolutely amazing. This game is just so massive. Okay. I'm running out of arrows. Oop. I might have to... Yeah, you're up too high. I can't... Forget it. I was trying to... Save it. Ooh, shot you in your face. 
Alright. Jet across. Run! Oh, one enough. Yo! Uh. Man, something over here sounds loud. Is that you guys? I don't remember you being that loud. Oop! I got one. Get it. Oh boy, I'm about to die. Kill that thing. And that thing. Okay. Oh, so chaotic. Okay, I kind of want to hit that bonfire, but at the same time, it's like I just cleared this little spot. So I think I'm going to run with it. What I'm nervous about, though, is if I die, the bonfire I last saved at, all the way down there in that tree. Oh, man, you know what? Now that I think about it, I really probably should. Jump. Get over here to this one. Uh, yeah, here we go. It's not that far away. Oh, okay. Now, I do know also... Well, that was up above when I found that little chamber, isn't it? How are we doing? Okay, we're doing fantastic on time. Um, found a little treasure just down here. Okay, yeah, somewhere up there going through the Blight Town area, the raffling above, I found a spot that looked kind of like this. Remember all the dogs? But I didn't go down there because I was like, I don't know how to get back. But I wanted to confirm that this was not that spot. And I have confirmed it. I want to go up on this side. Okay. Across here. Oop. Got it. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to get poisoned. I'm going to get poisoned. Oh. Uh, couldn't get up on that little ledge. And swing. Yes, I got them both. So I was hoping. Got you. And you. Man, this thing looks like it's gonna fall apart any time. Alright. Ooh, swinging at me. Alright, we're gonna keep going this way. I'll probably have to come down on the other side at some point, too, because I know there's still stuff over there I haven't necessarily explored, but at least I've been through that twice. This I've only been through once so far. And ba-boom! Oh, there's one right here. Oh, he came through the floor. And, uh. Don't fall, don't fall. <laughs> that was so close. I feel like my guy's foot even, like, shook a little bit. Like, like it almost walked off. Okay, armor head. I think I got whatever that was. Didn't I? Okay, should be another ladder around here somewhere. There we go. Higher I go, less I gotta deal with those annoying bugs, right? At least that's what I'm hoping. Okay, don't really see anything else right there. Hello, beautiful. <laughs> here to greet me at the top of the stairs, huh? Yeah, they sound kind of like lions. They're trying to sound intimidating. Okay, what's back here? Oh, what is this? What? Oh, what? Do I chance this? What's over there? 
Wait. What is this? You it's like it's like some kind of gladiator course or something where you gotta Oh, this better be worth it. I see a little platform below me. Oh what? I don't like this at all. If I fall. I might as well just kiss these souls to goodbye because I, I doubt I'm coming back for it. Tough enemy ahead. What? There's nowhere to move. Why tough enemy? Oh, terrible. Absolutely terrible. Oh, wait. There's no ladder. I thought there was supposed to be a ladder. Sorrow. Sorrow. Oh, I thought there was another platform to walk on. Is it illusionary wall? I'm not swinging. I'm not rolling. No way. I ain't chancing it. No way. I hear it sounds like dogs. That goes a long ways down too. Careful. How many, do you guys have anxiety right now? I have a crazy amount of anxiety right now. Oh, just go, go, go. Straight. Oh, that was terrible. And it was for nothing. Not worth that at all. Oh, I thought for sure something terrible was going to happen. Need amazing treasure. Don't we all? Like, no, okay. Sorry, I didn't feel safe trying to roll through that. I was definitely going the stabby route. Oh, this is more of that chamber, isn't it? Try jumping. Oh, something's pushing me over. Something was pushing me over as I went walking straight. Right there. Look, something's pushing me. Is that why it's saying trying to jump? Oh, that was terrible. I got the attention of something. Oh no, he's coming up. Oh. You know, I did wonder what happens if we're both on the ladder. Answers that question. My ladder. Jump. He's able to swing at me too. Oh, whoops. I knew that was going to happen. Sooner or later. Oh, we got a big guy up here too. Nope. Ooh. <laughs> that was a hit. Rolling back. Not this time, chump. So I thought. Oh. Such tiny little quarters. And ba boom. I see the message over there, but is it one of those I did it kind of messages or is it of actual use? <laughs> Maybe it's a try jumping method message. Dark. Yeah, I agree. It's dark here. Okay, I'm going back the way I came. I don't know what I'm finding through here. I don't know if this is... Oh. 
This isn't the way I came down. Is it, I, I don't recognize this area at all. Oh, I got the attention of a couple guys there. They're probably making their way this way. Maybe. I'm staying over here. I got a nice solid wall behind me, though. <laughs> it's taking him a minute. He's like, how do I get over there? <laughs> That'd be like me right now. If I was trying to work my way over to him. Should be one more. Ooh. Another broken toy. There he is. You can do it. Ugh. Whew. Noise. Okay. I'm glad they found their way to me. Uh, I don't see anything down that way. Break all that stuff. Wow. Oh, I see something lit up over there. Okay, we'll see if we can get to that. Okay, there's a torch. Probably a way to go up. Okay. Let's see if I can make my way over to this thing. Oh, another pyromancy. Power within. My goodness. Ooh. Can I? Hmm. I see the ladder. Is that something I have to like? I wonder if I have to come down on that thing. Oh, we got a we got two ladders. Where's this one go? Hmm. Where are you coming up from? Or down from? There he is. <laughs> so angry. My goodness. I love that they can slide down like we do. Oh. That's the way to go, dude. Okay. Where's this go? Hmm. Everything looks so samey. It's kind of hard to figure out. Okay, clearly I've been through here because that probably had something that I already picked up. So before I get too turned around, let's go back down and see what's on that other ladder. Over here. I'm being chased at the moment, I realize, but... Oh, there's something glowing over there. Maybe this is leading me that direction. Oh, hello. Oh, <laughs> surprise. That was pretty good, actually. Getting the drop of one of them for a change. Is he still running this way? Yo, there's like a dog running through all of this. Don't tell me the dog can climb the ladder. That would be really weird. Oh, hello. I'm so lost. I need a map. I need a map of the area. Gotcha. Now, is this lowering down to that little... That might be lowering down to that thing that I saw. Careful. I don't know if there's anything down here. I at least got to check. I saw the messages. 
Uh, try beating to a pulp. Be weary of death. Oh, I wonder if this is where the tentacle thing was. Remember how I told you I may not remember where that was? I wonder if that's where that little weird tentacle looking like thing was that I shot with the arrows. I'm going to guess that's probably what that was. So is it just a shortcut? Like if I was trying to come down, that'd be a faster... Oh. Oh, man. I got so nervous I was about to fall there. All right. We're back. Ugh. I'm scared to roll because there's just so little platform to work with in all this area. I don't want to fall. I've worked my way up to almost 9,000 souls. Oh. Die. Oh, yeah. Twin humanity. That came out of nowhere. I wonder if that's from somebody who, like, fell. Okay, I see another enemy over there. I wonder if that's the one that was chasing me earlier. Oh, how do I get... to that? really see very far. We got dogs over there. We got all kind. Oh, there's a lot of stuff over there. I don't walk across this teeny tiny little flimsy thing over here, do I? Oh, there went the dog again. I almost wonder if that dog's like a little hint. So if I go up that ladder, I can go across. Okay, yep, that looks like that might lead to where I'm trying to get to. There's a lot to be had over there. I'm a little nervous about a group of enemies we got right here, though. Woo! You almost! Almost got the drop on me. Okay, where'd that dog go? Mm. There it is. Hello, Poochie. Wow, I got almost 200 from that thing. Wouldn't have expected that. Okay. So does this go? Ooh, boy. Easy does it. Trying to be super careful. Ooh. Gotcha. Oh, he found me. Ooh, stabbed him in the air. You looked epic as you died, buddy. I'll give you that. Okay. I haven't found anything in any of these pots, but I keep breaking them open, hoping that I'll find something. Wow. There are glowy things everywhere. Oh, another bonfire. Oh! It scared the crap out of me. Is he here? There he is. If I hit this, though, that means everybody's coming back. Nice jump. Nice jump. You managed to get a stab on me because of it. Okay, well, I definitely need to hit this because... Am I still human? You know what? I might still be human at the moment. Let's just use a single. Uh, there we go. Because now if I die, at least I'm all the way up here and not, you know, going to spawn all the way down there at the bottom. This place is massive. Absolutely enormous. There we are. Oh man, I got 10,000 souls. Not enough for a level though. this read try head is there something with a big head coming up here can I get around that I ain't trying it no way okay we got stuff that way Let's see what's over here first they don't let you see very far do they uh 
my goodness. It's a labyrinth for sure. Hello, guys. Ooh. Oh, boy. Off me. Oh, my goodness, dude. Did I taste good? I've suspected I taste good. But I think you could now tell me if I'm nice and crunchy. Like I thought I was. Okay, I see something out there. Oh, what? What? There's got to be a different way. Those boards are going to push me right off, aren't they? I feel like that's a trick. Let's look from up here first. It's so rickety and... I can't see if there's like a ladder on the other side of that or not coming up. It sure don't look like it from here, but I don't know how else you would get out there. And I need to be able, like, I could try to run and jump from here, but I need to be able to walk out there and walk back. But I feel like these boards are going to just push me right off, the ones that are sticking up. Hardly see. Easy does it. Easy does it. <laughs> oh, what? Okay, well, that's the one to take out the toxin, so that's actually pretty valuable. All right, I'm going over here to turn around. I feel like there's more space for my big butt. My big crunchy butt. Uh, come on, come on. So glad nothing can shoot at me right now. If I was being attacked right now, I'd 100% be dead. Oh. This one time when, like, the glowy things are, like, debatable on if it's even worth trying for. I mean, look at this. That looks like it's going to break. Stupid. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Oh, boy. Yep. 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 Nope. Nope. I don't think so. I don't think so. Are... Okay, let's watch. Let's watch the blood stain here. It won't let me. You don't want to spoil a surprise that would try and tell me? There we go. Yep, they fell off. Is the trick here you have to run? There's a lot of blood right here. Mm, there's got to be another way. There has to be. I feel like that little... The fact that it swayed is like my warning that... Don't try it. All right. I'm going to take that advice. See if we can find another way down to that. Yo, that person was decked out with some amazing armor. I guess I don't need to hit that at the moment. Anything over there? No. I know I checked on one side, but... like directly below me. Is there not another ladder over here somewhere? Hmm. Maybe I can just walk off right here? Because I don't know how else to get over to there. Oh, I hope I hope I don't regret this. We're gonna try it. <laughs> I am standing in midair. I must be being held up by my weapon. Um Well, I didn't expect that. Oh, there's a dog. What? These are fire breathing dogs? I didn't know that. 
I mean, I guess that explains why they're like red hot. Okay, we got something up there. Let's take this. Have I been up this one yet? It don't look like it. Whoop. Oh! <laughs> Not sure what I was swinging at right there. If I could hear somebody else. Are you going to move too? What's over here? Oh. Nothing looks safe. Absolutely nothing. How do you guys live up here in this, huh? Don't you fear dying at any given moment? Oh, wow. There's a bunch of them. Come on down. I'll take care of you. <laughs> in the back. That felt mean. Oh! <laughs> that felt really mean. Is there still more? Sure sounds like there's still more. Wow, we're getting up kind of high here, aren't we? Okay, can I walk this way? Oh no, I'm seeing a lot of blood again. Oh, it looks like something you could jump to. I think I, I think I recognize this spot. This is close to where we came down, I think. Oh, and I think I had somebody tell me you can make that jump. It's like if I can jump to it, why can't I just walk to it as well somewhere? Oh, okay. I'm going to try. I hope I don't regret this. Oh, <laughs> what in the world is it? I Iota? How do you pronounce that? I Aito. Maybe it's <gasps> Is this one of those samurai ones that I've been telling that people have been telling me I should definitely try to get? A B for dexterity. Yeah, we're absolutely gonna have to give this thing a try. Twenty dexterity, fourteen strength. I got both of those. Oh yeah, it's a katana. Katana forged in the eastern land. The katana is drawn from the scabbard at lightning speed using an. Oh, I apologize up front. Uh, an ijutsu technique. I don't know. Uh, this technique allows the wielder to charge forward to swiftly cut down in distant foes. Wow. Absolutely going to give that. That was worth the leap of faith. Now, how do we get out of here, though? Do I have to just drop off somewhere? Leap over there. Ugh. Ooh, did you see that? I parkoured off that bad boy. I did a flip in the air. <laughs> I'm just showing off now. Oh, <laughs> that was amazing. Oh, I'm so glad I made the jump. Okay. So that's how I get back out was going up this ladder here. How can I get over to that glow over there? Oh! Jump! There we are. Hmm. It's like, almost like I need a flashlight. It, it looks like there's a ledge I can maybe just walk down to the edge of. Very carefully. Like, I gotta break something, maybe. Some debris to get to it. It almost looks like you get to it from up here. My goodness, there's a lot of stuff from up, up, up here. <laughs> I just don't know how to get to it. Oh, is this another jump? 
Actually, this may not be so bad. I might be able to just drop off of this. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Can't hardly see. Boards above me are blocking my view. Oh, okay. Grab and go. Yeah, that was worth it. I'm gonna need that stuff. I got me a katana to put a bunch of... Gotta put a bunch of souls into it. I see a glowy thing over there. How do I get to you? You got a teeny tiny ladder. Oh yeah, baby. We're making some progress. Ooh, shadow stuff. Oh, that looks so cool. I'll check that out here in a second. Point. Okay. I was kind of hoping that's what that was, actually. We got here shadow mask. That looks amazing. Oh, probably won't wear it, but it still looks really cool. Black cloth mask worn by spooks from an eastern land, designed so as not to hinder their unique form of martial arts. While it sacrifices defense for the sake of great mobility, it does offer resistance to bleeding and poison, among other things, perhaps due to the nature of espionage. Makes sense to me. I'm finding all this really lightweight stuff as I'm running around literally in probably the heaviest armor I've worn this whole playthrough. That seems kind of funny to me. Black cloth garb worn by spooks from an eastern land designed not to hinder... Okay. Okay. Yep. Looks like the rest of these are kind of saying the same thing now. Still super awesome to find. Now, how do I get out without dying? Roll. Oh. I was like, I see a little gap there. I ain't chancing it. Now, I dropped off of a ledge to get to this. How do I get back? Ultimate question time. This little path right there? No. Do I gotta jump across? I bet I gotta jump across there, don't I? Oh, so nervous. These jumps make me so anxious. Can I jump right from here? It's hard to tell. Oh yeah, it's not a very big jump. I think I'll be okay, but still. All right, I found all I want to find. I can't take this anxiety anymore. I gotta get out of here. I don't think I'm too far from my exit point. I feel like this has been a successful journey through Blight Town. Man, I do wish I could find another shortcut though that would take me all the way to the bottom of this much faster. You know without just jumping and dying. <laughs> it's nice that they got a little barricade right here so people know, don't walk off that. You know, they got some some safety measures in place. <laughs> this is the most unique set of creatures ever. I don't know if I trust the bridge there on the, the left. Let's go this way. A little bigger. I think there's a blow dart guy up here soon if I am where I think I am. Oop, yep. Gotcha. There we are. Okay. Let's put that back there. Yep, here's the big guys. Kind of where I thought we were. Oop, he turned around in time. Oh! Oh! No! <laughs> I couldn't even get away. That was time the instant I was able to move, he was swinging on me. That was terrible. That's all right. It's not too far away. I just gotta be extra cautious that I can get that before without accidentally dying. I knew that was going to be a tough fight. That's why I was trying to get the backstab on that one. Yeah. I know how you feel, buddy. That's kind of basically what just happened to me a minute ago. Just as I was getting up. Okay. Do I hear a dog coming at me? 
I feel like I hear a dog coming. Some dog knocks me off this bridge. Uh, I'm gonna be furious. Ba Boom! Not that one. There's another one right down here. I'll wait for these. I'm not gonna get impatient. I will wait. They shall come. Whoa! Don't fall. Don't fall. Oh! <laughs> Don't be so dramatic, my goodness. Okay, I know my souls are close. I just gotta be careful. I'm being extra careful. Although maybe it'd be better to trigger these guys so they go ahead and come at me. Oop, there's one. Ooh, walking all the way over and then make your lunge. I see how you is. Okay. I should at least be able to pick those up before he turns around and puts a hit on me. Oh, I'm filling up. These guys hit hard. Oh, it's right behind him. Oh. Boop. Oh, there we got one. Ooh. My goodness, he got me with that. Oh, who else is here? Where'd you come from? Okay. Drink. Oh. Okay. There we go. Okay. A little more under control now, I think. Oh. Get one on him. Yeah, I saw that opportunity. Chump. Oh. I felt like I was in control of everything that was happening there, but man, I was still so nervous. Okay. A little bit further to my exit point. I'm still so so nervous. Yeah. Ugh. Sit down, chump. Oh, I'm not locked on. I do feel like they get like health back or something when they first stand back up. Like, sometimes I'm like, man, I thought your health bar was lower than that. You know, honestly, I don't even remember where I first came down here from. Oh, I remember now. This is where the rats and all that were at. I really am taking the long way back out of here, aren't I? That's all right, though. Oh, my goodness. We're way past the hour mark. I, I totally lost track of time. Sorry, buddy. Uh, I tell you what, though, it was successful. I found all kinds of fun loot. Okay. Now, I remember... Oh, yeah, we got more of the slugs dropped from the ceiling. The depths. Uh, where'd this go? Let's get me out of here. Hmm. Nope. Although, maybe if I followed on around. I was trying to see. I know the bonfire's not too far away here. That Okay, that's not where that was. Look how much... These guys still... They must have some pretty high resistance. They still take a lot of hits. Okay, let's head up here. I know where I'm at. I know where I'm at. I'm a, I'm a Dark Souls pro now. No, as much as I'd like to think so. Hello. 
Oh, come on, dude. Kind of a point you trying to prove. Huh? Alright. Let's hit this. Oh, okay. I can relax here and do my outro. What a fantastic run. No big boss fights or anything, but man, we found a ton of loot. New outfits, new... Uh, found some souls, got that weapon, the katana. I'm super excited for that. I've I've had people, it's been a while back now, but they said for a dexterity build, the katana is a fantastic weapon. So I'm excited to put that on. I think I'm going to continue to keep the halberd, at least for now. I'm going to keep it in its raw form. Now, I have had people say that you can revert it and then level it like, you know, a, a normal weapon if I want to after that, but I will have to re-get all the resources. So... Uh, that's, that's nice to be aware of, uh, but I'm going to see if I really love the katana, I might try to make that like my, my long-term weapon and then keep this one as like a backup for when I need something with some good length to it. I don't know. Maybe the katana has some good length to it when I'm swinging that around. I don't know. Oh man, that was so successful. I made it all the way up through Blight Town. So in the next episode, I think what we're going to do is continue to work our way out of the depth. We're going to make our way back to the blacksmith, do some work there, hopefully be able to get the katana into a, a good spot. If I need to do a little bit of grinding on the stone soldiers just to get some more souls for purchasing shards or whatever, we might do a little bit of that. Uh, I try to avoid doing too much of that in an episode just because that, that's probably not very entertaining to watch. But the big goal on the next one is to see what's on the other side of that gate that we raised. I'm super curious to see what's going to be over there, and we're going to find out on the next episode. Until then, continue to be safe out there, buddy. I'll see you on the next one.